Hey guys, welcome back to this channel, it's Nick Memes here, Islamic Condition Trader and in this video I will be showing you the full tutorial of how Pounded Fund works. It is a place where you can buy and sell all of those newly launched Solana Meme coins literally at 5k dollars in market cap and this will be the full tutorial and the only tutorial you will ever need will literally cover absolutely everything. As you can see, first of all, the website's name is Pumped Fun, if you don't know. And you can trade some uh, meme coins here, and you can sort them by creation time. And you can see, all of those meme coins are newly, newly launched. So pretty much this is a pre-sale website, because if you click on how it works, you will learn from here that at 60 k dollars in market cap, so Pumped Fun coins, if they have enough demand, will migrate from Pumped Fun to Radium and so it will be lively tradable for absolutely everyone on Radium and on Dex Screener and Photon. Of course Dex Screener is a chart and Photon is a platform and it has charts as well and I will be covering all of those tools as well in this video as they basically burn liquidity and deposit the coin to Radium. And you can see coins which literally re reached hundreds of millions of dollars in market cap from Pumped Fun. For example, Michi, Sharkcat, and so many other coins which are really, really popular at the moment. Sharkcat, for example, currently has $150 million in market cap and it was launched on Pumped Fun at just 5k. As you can see, this is its Pumped Fun chart and now it's so high up. So if you caught this coin, this would literally make you a bank. You could buy a house if you traded that coin and put in a couple of so. But we also need to cover what is King of the Hill. And King of the Hill basically is a free spotlight promotion for any coin that reaches 30k dollars in market cap. As you can see from here, and they get dethroned as soon as new king of the hill is found, as soon as another coin reaches 30k dollars in market cap, but this basically is a free promotion for a token. And also, you can trade Pound Fund tokens from here. You just need to connect your wallet from here, and any of those wallets will work. And the best one is Phantom or Soulflair. And Phantom is really easy to install. You just need to go to Phantom dot app which is their official website and you'll be able to download phantom for desktop as an extension and then you'll find it from here as you can see i've already have phantom installed but if you're on a phone ipad ios android device then you can just go to google play or app store and get phantom from there no problem now here you can learn about the coins name and the description as well as the socials as well. As you can see from here, every single coin usually has at least one social with a telegram, twitter or a website and the more the better. If they have all three, that is amazing. If they have none, that is sketchy. This is most likely to be a rug if it has no socials and no nothing. Also, Hold the distribution another extremely important thing to look at because if someone holds a large percent from a token supply, those are most likely to be rugs. No one should own more than 5% of a token, whether a developer or another trader, and 7% is slightly too much, but it's still fine. However, Anything over 10%, I wouldn't even look at that coin. Developer is holding 2%, so that is nice. This thread section is a place where you can just post a comment if you have connected your wallet with Pumped Fun. You can see the community talking here. You can see the developer usually talking here as well. You can basically see whether the community is bullish on this coin or bearish, and this is really, really helpful for you to help decide whether this coin is something worth to get into or not. And sometimes some guys are calling out scams here as well, like serial pumped fun ruggers who are just creating many coins to rug you and you can just find 
those accusations from here and do your own research whether they hold true from looking at holder distribution or looking at trades. Trades is a section where you can just screen the volume of those coins. You can see transactions happening, you can see how much they were bought for and all kinds of things. Also, if you want to prevent yourself from getting corrupt, you should always scroll down below to screen for sketchy transactions. If you see some sketchy activity, like someone buying 3 or 5 so early on into this random token, that is likely to be a rug, unfortunately. So this website aims to be a rug-free website, as they're claiming here, so liquidity can't be pulled out of those tokens. However, you can get rugged if someone is holding the, the supply from different wallets, for example. Sometimes the developer buys from like three to four wallets, for example, uh, like 5% each, and then eventually he dumps on you at the same time. So there is a cabal lurking on Pounded Fund for sure. And you really need to be careful when you're looking at those tokens. And the best way to find them is sorting this by bump order. Because you're going to see every coin which bumps, they either have a buy or sell, or they have a reply made. So they have an activity and they are popular, hence they are here. One thing I would also suggest you to do is turn show animations off because it's so hard to click on any of those coins where they are bumping for you. So now it's standing still and it's more convenient to look at those coins. For example, we can open this coin and you also should examine the chart. Always, the chart can tell you a lot about the coin, about its price action, about the volume and all of that. And the best indicator really is volume. Believe it or not, volume is super, super helpful. So when you look at the trade section, it can show you all the transactions. Sure, it can show you the quantity of transactions, yes, but it can't really tell whether volume is downtrending or uptrending. And it's really, really important because usually when volume uptrends, the price action uptrends as well. When volume goes down, the coin's price action also goes down. And here, one thing I want to emphasize as well, you can see those small transactions, which are legit, is the community buying this token. You can see it's the same guy just buying and selling it and creating fake volume so that the coin can appear in this bump order section uh, and be the first one on the list. So that can be a good or a bad sign. If it's the community, it's good. If they do this teamwork and bump the token up, you can see it always keeps coming up, the token we looked at, as you can see again. But sometimes it's a developer doing so to bait you in to his rug. So you always got to examine the coin for a rug pool. Now, another thing you should do, once you already have your Phantom Wallet ready, you have some Solana, you deposited the Solana from a centralized exchange, like Binance or Coinbase, KuCoin or any of those exchanges, and you have your Solana on Phantom Wallet, you actually shouldn't be trading here. Even though you have an opportunity to do so, it's really, really slow, and those meme coins are really really time sensitive and here your swaps will most likely fail or take too long and as you know or if you don't know yet those coins can go up and down in literally seconds those coins are really really volatile therefore also risky so you guys got to keep that in mind those coins really are pumps and dumps and you should be using photon that's why i want to tell you that it's it's better photon is a platform with the most fast charts and what you can do is copy the tokens address just this part copy it and then paste it to your photon and photon you also need your phantom wallet to connect with it then you paste the token and we found our token buris joson as you can see and by the way it's a trend presidents are trending and it's misspelling of a name, so it's kind of a double trend. But you can see the chart here is amazing, and it's currently at one minute candle. Um, as you can see, this each candle here is one minute, but you can set it to one second, which is better,
because you're trading fast coins which have price action uh, literally every second going up or down so you want to be looking at one second charts and pound fund doesn't have this function it only has five minutes which is super super inconvenient and it doesn't show you the market cap it shows you the market cap from here but from here you're looking at random numbers hence you should use foron you can select it by market cap so you can see those round numbers which is way more helpful when it comes to trading you can see volume and you can pick any indicators that you like from foron and you can trade with foron as well as you can see from here you can buy and sell on foron and this is the best platform really fastest charts you can trade and sell really really amazing another thing i want to emphasize is that those coins usually most of them never even go up in the first place if you sort coins by creation time you can see they are launched at 5k dollars in market cap and most of them 99 percent of them never go up in the first place that is the issue with those coins so you got to be careful that you do not buy into a dead coin as you can see from here this developer bought this coin and then he sold this coin you can see he bought for one soul and he sold for 0.2 so which is just i don't know 20 cents profit or two bucks profit but those coins never go up in the first place and coins that do go up like this one for example or any other coin 99 percent of them die as well so the usual pattern is really this the first wave goes up and goes down forever now when it comes to picking your coins you have to understand which coins to choose of course and just need to look for repetitive deems to spot a trend or narrative for example this is one of the strategies you can use when it comes to trading compounded fun here you can see one cat two cats three cats four cats uh, you can see a dog you can see a pepe all of them are trending long term cats are like number one long term trend but sometimes you can find short-term trends which are from the news or from the media. Next thing I'm going to show you is how to use Dex Screener. We'll take a look at just a random coin. Let's take a look at Sharkcat. And they go to Dex to Radium and Dex Screener at $60k in market cap. So Dex Screener is pretty much a chart platform. And it's just the same as Photon, but it's 10 or 5 seconds slower. But it does have the same functions so if you want to you can look at dex screener you will see coins uh, candles which you can switch one second one minute five minutes 15 and so on you can also look at market cap from here and you can also track the volume volume you can also track in photon but i haven't told you that before it's important to look at the volume from here what is the last five minute volume of a coin one hour volume also important and 24 hour volume how is it trending up trending down trending is it sufficient because if coins have no volume the coins won't pull any sort of magic move they need volume in order to move and the key when it comes to those coins really is the community so those coins must have really great communities in order to moon which you can find from telegram so you need to join coins telegram literally 100 percent of the times which i'm going to show you how to do right now you just join the channel probably verify yourself uh, in this coin's case there isn't a verification but they oftentimes have voice chats as you can see from here so you can talk to the developer you can learn about his vision you can pretty much screen him whether he is a transparent person or not because the developer is also a key of a project and if he sells out the projects dump really really quickly so for example this project the developer is holding five percent of his token but guess what guys if the developer sells out you are gonna see a big dump in the chart it's simply going to go back to zero literally every single coin so having a nice developer is so important because most of them just will sell their stake will sell will sell their supply will sell their token and everyone will panic sell 
You can see this coin, for example, went from 5k dollars in market cap to 60k on Pump.Fun and then it migrated to Radium and it went from 60k to 400k, which is insane. It's almost 100x, it's 80x to be precise. And those coins you can also trade on Radium, as I told you before. You can trade them on Radium, you can look at them on Dex Screener, or you can trade them on Photon, or even on Trojan Bot. I'm going to wrap up this video here, guys. I think I literally covered every single aspect of trading on Pounded Fun. I actually have a course coming, which will have a free version and free section, as well as a paid one. So keep an eye on the description and on the pinned comment. You'll most likely find my Discord day and Telegram, so make sure you join, it's free and made for the community guys. So peace out and come back for more.